Let's see how many brain cells you get, princess. Oh my. The mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. Two identical twins will never have the same fingerprint. You're five, how do you know that? Well, my queen, she... She what? How is she so smart? That's because I have more brain cells than the average human. She has more brain cells than me. This can't be. Your body language and tone of voice indicates that you're coming up with an evil plan. Stepdaughter, don't be silly. <laughs> For the last time, it's not poisoned. Well, your body language does show that you're not lying, so... Okay, stepmother, I'll try some. <gasps> yes, my potion worked. I said it wouldn't poison you, but I never said anything about it making you stupid. <laughs> <laughs> I go potty now. Wait, no, no, no. <gasps> oh, oh, my new shoes. That's it, princess. Just have your special drink. <laughs> princess, hey, I'm, uh, I'm Prince Derek, and I was wondering if you'd want to go on a date with me. I know you don't have a lot of brain cells, but... Ow. Hey, are you good? Help. What's going on? My brain, it's... The potion is wearing off. Excuse us, Prince Derek. It's the princess's nap time. Hurry up and drink the potion. <clears throat> I mean, drink your drink. There you go. It's going to make you feel so much better. Yes, she's back to being dumb. <laughs> sleep, sleep, dream, dream, eat, eat, barf. Your Majesty, the people of the kingdom are concerned about the princess. Oh, really? They think she's unfit to be queen with such little brain cells. Well, I must say I agree. Potato. She could never be queen. <laughs> Dingly dangly. How could she have lost almost all her brain cells? Life is full of mysteries. Now follow me, we have important business to attend to. Princess. Oh, I know I'm kind of breaking in, but don't be scared. Huh? I climbed all the way up here because I want to help you. No one deserves to have such little brain cells. Earlier, it seemed like you were trying to tell me something. Handsome. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, please stop, that tickles. Uh, I just wanted to tell you that I'm gonna try and find you a potion that can make you smarter. Okay, so I'm gonna climb back down your tower now. And he was a fairy. Wait, what? No, no, no! Uh, uh, ah. Ah. I think I just pushed Prince Derek out the window. <gasps> Prince Derek? He's alive! He landed on a giant pile of pillows, but what are a giant pile of pillows doing outside my castle? Your Majesty, the hundred thousand pillows you ordered have arrived. Excellent. Figures. Uh, what happened? Oh, he's waking up. I'm so sorry. Listen, I'm gonna think of a way to save you. I just need more of my brain cells to come back. Come on, think. I think I have an idea. Come on. Oh, almost there. Oh, I'm up. Nice thinking using the sheets. Are you okay? Yeah, I'd say I'm doing pretty good for someone who just got pushed out of tower. <laughs> Listen, I am so sorry. This is what I was trying to tell you. The queen, she's been giving me a potion that's been taking away my brain cells. Oh my gosh, yeah, I just realized you're talking normal now. Has she been doing this to you for years? There he is. He's in here, gods. Take him away. Ugh. He is the prince from the rival kingdom, and he was trying to poison the princess. No, stop. Wait, the queen is lying. Don't listen to the princess. Remember, she only has ten brain no. cells. No, I'm smart now. My brain cells are coming back. I Silence. That's enough. Take this. You're going to drink that potion right now, or I will have the prince killed. Drink it, or the prince dies. Good girl. Wait a minute, you little fake. Drink it for real. I can see your brain cells. <laughs> That's better. After all these years, the potion is starting to lose its power. It's wearing off much too quickly, and we can't have that happening, so I'm going to have to, um, get rid of you. Me go bye-bye? Yes, I can't have you becoming queen. No, no, don't cry. Here, take this. Ah. Can't have you alerting the gods now. Soft, soft. You're going to be an easy kill. Come here. Don't leave this room. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to think of a way to make the prince and your death look like an accident. Hello. Me, see cute, cute prince. Princess, you're not supposed to be down here. And the prince isn't allowed any visitors, but... But go ahead. Just be real quick, because the queen doesn't want you seeing them in the dungeon. Sublime. Uh, you're welcome. The queen wants me dead, 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 and she's gonna have your head. Uh, princess! No, she gave you the potion. Hey, princey, look. Dingly dingly. The key? Where did you get that? Me see big guard sleeping and shiny thing, so me takey. <laughs> okay, well hurry, unlock my cell door and then... Sorry, use shiny thing to free Prince. Oh! <laughs> Good, now throw me the key so I can unlock these chains. KK. Hey, you two aren't allowed to be... 
Sorry, what was that? Couldn't quite hear you. Muscular Riz. Me likey. Come on, we have to get to- oh. Princess! Brain cells, all of them, coming back fast. Hey, you got this. The faster your brain cells come back, the faster you can outsmart the queen, alright? Oh. No, outsmart me. I don't think so. Stop, you can't do this, it's against- mm. I don't understand. I'm the princess. You're not supposed to be doing this. Why are you guys listening to her? They're under an obedience spell, dear. They'll do whatever I say. Surprised you didn't figure that out with all those brain cells of yours. Here, drink this. And this time, it's not a potion. You poisoned this? So what makes you think that I'm gonna drink it? I'm willing to trade you, your life, <sighs> for his. You made me dumb my whole life, you know that? Years of my life that I will never get back. Oh, please, you were on cloud nine. You know what they say, ignorance is bliss. I was doing you a favor. But to show you that I mean business... <sighs> no, Derek! You know how you can save him, dear. You are a monster. People do crazy things to remain in power. So what do you say? Deal. No. That a girl. Just one sip is all it will take. <laughs> oh, this is so sad to watch. Now open up your cup so I can see. I only put a little bit in there, so let me see the bottom. Oh! <laughs> Looks like I finally outsmarted you. Ugh. Ugh. What the heck is going on? The queen had you under a spell. She was abusing her power. Please, set us free. <sighs> the prince has lost a lot of blood, but the medic might not get here in time. I could save him if I just had a few more brain cells. Come on, please. I know how to save him. Guards, I need the royal medical kit and gloves right now. Yes, yes princess, princess, as you as wish. wish. Derek, hey, I'm gonna need to give you some stitches, okay? So, please, just close your eyes. Yeah, I think I'm gonna pass out instead. Or that works too. Okay, it's done. The medic will take him from here. You did great. I hope so. Good news, princess. Prince Derek is recovering. He's going to be alright. But his father from the rival kingdom is here and he wants to speak with you. Send him in. Hello, your majesty. You! Your stepmother kidnapped my son! And you! You saved his life. And for that... I am forever grateful. Oh, well, it was the least I could do. Oh, don't be so humble. I see you're going to become queen soon. Wouldn't you want a king to be by your side? <laughs> <laughs> Just make sure to keep my son in mind. You two could have some very smart children. Uh, excuse me, princess. The prince requested to see you. Uh, oh, hey. Well, if it isn't the smartest girl I know. Look, I wanted to say thank you for saving my life. I had no idea you had so many brain cells. Part of me kind of misses you being dumb. Excuse me? Wait, I didn't mean it like that. It's just you said some funny things, like me having muscular riz. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I must say, you do have some pretty big muscles. Ugh. Oh, I'm so sorry. No, it's okay. It's worth the pain. You know, your father was saying he thinks that we should get married. Really? Well, you're the smart one. What do you think? I think it sounds like a pretty good idea. As long as you're comfortable with it, you know, um, I'm not trying to rush things. It's just- Whoa, hey. I'll tell you what, as soon as I'm able to, I'll be down on one knee for you. <laughs>